Hi and welcome back to my video series Shadowing and Dead Zone for Beginners. This time I'm gonna play Zone Control again just to show you a little bit more maps and more things to take care of. My last video I also equipped Big Boy so now I'm gonna use it. It takes a while to find a game. And here we are again at Palace, this time from the start. If we had more spawn points, now right now I'm on the red team, we only have A if we had B. I could switch here to B and start at B, but it has to do with A. When I'm hitting the tap button I can see who's on my team and who's on the opponent team. Some guy with no name is on my team. He's rank 11. The opponents are Ahmed and King Joe. Ahmed spawned now. Yeah, a little bit higher ranked. I'm gonna sprinting to take B first. The closer you are to the center, the faster you take over the zone. And now we're sprinting towards C, probably just like our opponents. So I'm moving a little bit to the side so I don't get hit by their nades. Hiding. And I can see only Ahmed is alive. So where is he? Uh, there he is hiding. King Joe doesn't want to rush. He prefers to hide as well. Now I'm trying to take over D. I'm switching to big boy now. Otherwise I run out of ammo if there are so many people at once. But it didn't work out. But C is ours, so now I can click on C or A or B to decide where to spawn. And I decided for C just to be faster. can see by time our team grows so now we have four players versus four it's just people who joined a little bit later this is a turret it aims at everybody from the opponent team and is pretty deadly so avoid running straight to the into them you can only destroy them by kicking them or by throwing an EMP grenade. So they are hiding around the corner. I try to make it alive around there. But I didn't make it. Oh, and I should have switched to D instead of C. So I don't have to sprint that whole way. Let's see where I'm hiding. I got him. This time D. One of them is still alive. I don't know, it's three of them. One of them is hiding back there. No one's alive. And we took the zone, so the match is over. I 
And here you can see I made the first place. I got the most XP, 14 kills and 3 deaths. Ahmed was my prey because I killed him 5 times. And he was also my nightmare because he killed me once. And no one else killed me more often. We get a 1000 XP bonus and $500 bonus for being the winner of the match. So this should be enough to upgrade my big boy a little bit. It needs a better accuracy, so we buy it. Now we can also check the casino, because every day you get a new chip. And it seems someone just won the jackpot, because $2000 is the minimum that is in the jackpot. So we wait before we spin until the jackpot reaches at least 3000 or more dollars. And we can see we just need 2600 XP to rank up again. Uh, we're probably gonna do it later. 